Welcome back to my new video. This is Motion Designer and in today's video, we're going to create this in After Effects. All right, let's go and create a new composition, which is a five second long. Hit OK. Layer new solid and BG for the background and go to the effects and presets and type in gradient and select this four color gradient, drag and drop. And you can change this to your desired color. So once you're done with the background, you can select the text and type in your text, which is speed, right? So align it to the center of the composition and maybe lower it down to 200. Maybe, yes, that's fine. All right, so let me go and drag and drop the texture just below the text. By the way, I'm going to include this texture in the download file. So you can download this project file from the link below. All right, so once you're done with that, go to the track mat and change this to all format, right? So go to the effects and presets and type in curves and drag and drop the curves in the texture and give a little bit of contrast like what I'm doing here. Once you're done with the design of the text, let's move on to the next step, which is adding an electric Glow. So create a new solid and rename this Saber, hit OK and go to the effects and presets and search for Saber. By the way, this is a free After Effects plugin by Video Copilot. I'll also link this in the description down below. You can go and download this. So once you added that, change this blending mode to add and you can see here. All right, let's go inside these effects controls and collapse this customized score change this core type from saber to text layer and in the text layer you can select the text layer which is the speed and right away you can see here go and lower this glow intensity to maybe 20 and core size to maybe one for now and let's go ahead and animate this end offset right so set a keyframe for this end offset Hold down shift and hit page down five times. One, two, three, four, five. And set this to zero. And go to the preset and you can select any preset that you like. I'll go for the trick or maybe energize is fine. And lower this intensity to 25 and maybe two. All right. so. That is, uh, maybe I'll add a flicker, maybe 25 flicker, right? So select this saber layer, control D to duplicate, hit U to bring up the keyframes and offset this timing a little bit and maybe even change the color, say 15 and close size to go maybe two like that. All right, once you're done with this, Select all of the layers except for the background and right click, pre compose, hit OK, and make sure you change this blending mode to add again so that the background is visible. All right, so go to the effects and presets, go to the effects and presets and type in CC scale wipe. So drag and drop this on that pre compose layer and change this to 90 and even 90 and maybe negative 90 right negative 90 and i'm going to animate this center right from here go to the first keyframe first frame set a keyframe on the center and one two three four five and you reveal this like this right so all you have is let's see all right, that is how you can create this effect. I hope you like this video. Thanks a lot for watching. This is Bean Motion Designer and I will see you in my next video. Take care.